Under bright blue skies, a flotilla approaches. And with a blast of explosives, the amphibious assault begins. A mock invasion performed by U.S. and South Korean Marines. This weekend's drills are one small part of an eight-week series of joint military exercises that both countries perform annually. With more than 300,000 South Korean troops and 17,000 U.S. forces participating, South Korea says this year's drills are the biggest ever. They're taking place during a time of heightened tension on the Korean Peninsula. This is an opportunity for the U.S. to reassure its South Korean ally within months of North Korea, testing what it claims was a hydrogen bomb and firing, and firing a satellite into space. The U.S. argues this show of force serves as a deterrent to North Korea. We sincerely believe in peace through strength, and it is in the strength of our alliance that we believe that we can deter and avoid war. But North Korea calls these exercises a threat. Pyongyang claims the U.S.-South Korean drills are a precursor to a possible invasion, and it has threatened to carry out preemptive nuclear strikes in response. Of course, North Korea often makes big shows of its own war games. Just last week, the regime released images of leader Kim Jong-un observing a missile launch. This came just days after Pyongyang announced it successfully miniaturized a nuclear bomb, making it small enough to fit on top of a missile. Some South Koreans are disturbed by the saber-rattling on both sides of the demilitarized zone. There is some opposition to these drills. You have several dozen demonstrators, some of whom have traveled hours to get here. They are arguing that it's better to have peace talks rather than military exercises. And as you can see, there is a substantial police presence keeping the protesters at bay. The nearby protests do not disrupt the military exercises. This, after all, is a carefully choreographed operation part of a cycle of tension between North and South that ratchets up every year during the joint military exercises. The danger here, if one of these well-armed rivals makes a misstep or misinterprets an enemy signal, then the risk of escalation is very, very high.